Welcome everybody at this breakout session of InfoSecurity. From Proximus, today we're going to talk about managing clouds in an evolving world. And after this session, there's going to be a live Q&A moment where you can ask all your questions. Let me introduce myself. I am Jetro Wils and I am the product manager of a hybrid cloud at Proximus. And today I also have my colleague Thierry with me. Thank you Jetro for that short introduction. My name is Thierry Van Uffle. I'm also a product manager at Proximus and I'm specialized in public cloud. Now let's start setting the scene a little bit, how cloud computing has changed the way we approach the market. If we look at the last five years, hosting business application has changed dramatically. There's SaaS elements that come to into play. We have DevOps as a framework that's uh, also new for a lot of companies. And there are the GDPR rule sets where we have to comply. So if we take that all into account and you're planning your ICT strategy for the future, it's important to take some quite important decisions now that will impact on a long run your business. And it's no longer the size of the company that's the most important part, but the speed and agility with which a company is able to deliver their solutions to the market. Where we're all working in IT and we don't want to be a cost center for our business, we want to be an innovation hub that drives the business value. So let's go a little bit more into depth on that part, how Proximus and Cloud Fusion can help realize your future. We understand that cloud computing changes the game. Digital companies, they live in a world of constant change and they value the economy of speed. What does that mean? If you take a look at a traditional company, you see that they have an as-is state. The current situation, everything is normal and fine. And then they have a desire to do something better and it's a to-be situation. And the middle is a project. It has a beginning and an end. And once the project has been delivered, it's back to business as usual, steady state. That is the traditional way of doing business. A digital company is living in a world of constant change. Every day there are changes. There is no status quo and no stability in that sense. And thus they value having fast deliveries, a high velocity, and thus they value an economy of speed. Cloud computing supports this. Now, before we dive into cloud computing, I want to share with you the difference between a traditional data center, because it is different on five major capabilities. And these come from the American Institute for Science and Technology. Number one, a, a cloud has an on-demand self-service. What that means is that when you as a customer want to deploy a workload, you can do it yourself on the cloud. Gone are the days that you had to log a ticket, wait a couple of days and see the response by somebody else. So the cloud really empowers self-service. Number two, it has a broad network access. A cloud is not a small server room with just one fiber channel. This is something that can be expanded over the entire world with a global reach. And so a cloud has a high available setup. Number three, there is resource pooling. So in a cloud, the hardware underneath is shared amongst multiple customers. You don't even know which hardware exactly there's running. While in your local server room, you know exactly which hardware you want and which type you want. Number four, rapid elasticity. In the cloud, you have the ability that when a workload is under pressure, like for example, a website that gets many traffic visitors at the same time, there is a scale out to support that load and scales down again after the peak load has you know, uh, been gone away. And so for that, we have rapid elasticity. And number five, there is a measured service. With a cloud, you know exactly what you have consumed down to the day, hour, minute, or in some cases, even the second. And so with these five points, we can say that a cloud is different from a data center. But a cloud has multiple flavors. And we at Proximus, we embrace multi-cloud in a hybrid context. So when it comes to cloud computing, the hybrid flavor is the reality and multi is the choice. Now this quote comes from the great, great book Cloud Strategy by Gregor Hopfe. And in this book he writes, no CIO will wake up one morning to find all their workloads into the cloud. 
there is always something that's left on site in your local data center and parts of it are in the cloud. So this hybrid setup is the reality. Now, when I shared this book on LinkedIn, I got a great comment from the CIO of BNP Paribas Germany, who states that this book is a must read for all CIOs, IT directors and IT managers. So go ahead and read this book if you haven't done so already. Now, cloud computing comes in different flavors, like we just mentioned. If you have the traditional one, it just means that you have an on-premise data center, local server room, and you activate a public cloud, which can happen in 10 minutes with a Visa card. You basically just have yet another data center. It's not really using the cloud powerfulness or power. So what that means is there is also a second flavor, which is multi-cloud. And with multi-cloud, you activate multiple clouds next to each other to run specific workloads for that cloud, but they're not connected. For example, you have an SAP environment running in Google Cloud and you have some local or custom software on Azure Cloud. That's a multi-cloud setup. The third flavor, on the other hand, is actually the hybrid cloud. And we believe this is the reality for most corporations and businesses. The hybrid cloud connects whatever you have on premise with the public cloud or another cloud provider. And the workloads are connecting together and working together. This for us is the reality. Now let's take a closer look to the eight scenarios that we have identified that have a hybrid cloud use case. We can split them up in three major blocks. We have use cases, scenarios around applications. We have some scenarios around data and we have some scenarios around operations. Now to take one of the use cases in the application world, tiered applications are an early candidate to go in a hybrid world. You can put the front end into a public cloud, taking the benefits of auto scaling for that front end and securing the back end on your own on premise. Another use case can be data. Data sensitivity is quite important. You can offload non-sensitive data to the public cloud, keeping control over the sensitive data on-prem, but freeing up space and making your life easier. If we look to operations, there a use case can be disaster recovery. What happens if worst comes to worst and your plant is no longer there? It can be very useful to have a disaster recovery solution in the public cloud ready when you need it. Thank you, Terry, for that wonderful explanation of why we need hybrid cloud. At Proximus, we recognize this hybrid reality. That's why we have Cloud Fusion. Proximus Cloud Fusion is our new solution for multi-cloud management in a hybrid world. Now, what does it mean? Cloud Fusion is an ecosystem for business critical applications that brings high performance, reliable hybrid and multi-cloud with a SaaS experience. Now let's break that down into smaller chunks. It's an ecosystem. Cloud Fusion is not just a portal. It contains also services around it. Managed services, professional services, consultative services. In addition to that, it's business critical. It is designed to run your business critical applications on our systems. That way you have peace of mind. Cloud Fusion is a high performance. We have invested over a million euros in our data centers to ensure that we have the most powerful and important hardware in the system. So everything is compute intensive, ready to run your high performance workloads. Also, it is reliable. It is built on two geo-redundant Belgian data centers. So we're okay with GDPR and everything is double. So in a high available setup. If one data center should uh, go out, the other one takes over instantly. Also, Cloud Fusion is hybrid and multi-cloud compatible. So just like we talked about hybrid as the reality, Cloud Fusion can handle that. Or if you choose multi-cloud, Cloud Fusion can handle that. And lastly, it is for you as a customer, SaaS, software as a service, meaning you don't need to install anything. Proximus keeps it secure, patched, updated, healthy, up and running all the time. So let's take a look at the architecture of Cloud Fusion. If you take a look at the bottom left part, you can see the Proximus private cloud. 
And just like I mentioned, it's fully modernized with a softer defined network with a hyperconverged infrastructure on top, everything connected safely and securely, ready to run your workloads. On the right side, you see the public cloud, like Microsoft Azure or like Google Cloud, can be Amazon as well. And on top of that, you have the cloud management platform, which we use Morpheus for. And this enables you to manage both clouds at the same time. And on top of that, we have our ITSM service portal, which enables you as a customer to log tickets, ask questions, or raise incidents. And for that, we use ServiceNow. So this is the high-level overview of our architecture. Now, let me share with you that Cloud Fusion supports mixed environments. It is the reality to mix things because we're living in a hybrid IT world. And so you will recognize these five solution lines from Proximus. We have housing solutions. You rent square meters in our data center, but it's your hardware. We have the private cloud. It's our hardware and you lease the compute power and storage power for that. We have Proximus Azure, which is our public cloud service for Microsoft Azure. We have Proximus Edge, which is a new solution, which is basically Azure Stack enabling you as a gateway or a bridge between on-site and public cloud. And lastly, we have the traditional classical on-premise with your hardware in your place. Now, Cloud Fusion is backed up by the Proximus connectivity, of course. And today we focus on bridging the gap between the private cloud and Proximus Azure. This is our current focus. And as a customer, you can benefit from this bridge. However, our vision is much wider than that. We want to actually engulf everything. We want to go from housing all the way down to on-premise so that with one solution, you can manage them all. Now, if you take it one step further into this thought, you can see that if we take those five solution lines and just like combine edge and on-premise here, you can see 12 combinations. There are 12 IT landscape combinations, and all of them have the same need, namely unified management. And for that, we provide Cloud Fusion. So what that means for you as an IT manager or CIO is whatever your landscape at your business is, Cloud Fusion supports it. Whether you are a startup with just cloud native tooling and only public clouds all the way down to you only have something in, in housing, in the proximus housing, we have a solution for you. Cloud Fusion. And also we embrace multiple public clouds. We embrace Azure, Google Cloud, and Amazon. And for that, let's zoom in on Azure for a moment. Thank you, Jetro. Let's have a closer look to the public cloud. The public cloud can look like an endless box full of Lego bricks. You can find bricks for infrastructure as a solution, problems, platform as a solution, software as a solution, and function as a solution, packaged. Beside those four main building blocks, we can also find topic solutions, like there for machine scale sets, for containerized workloads, for IoT, for AI, and for big data analytics. The problem becomes choice and how to control that choice. What we don't want is a new silo to manage. We don't want sprawl of workloads without having a view on them. And we don't want all or nothing scenarios. What we dream of is keeping clear control over our deployments, keeping the costs, costs into control, ensuring compliance and in empowering our business users to go further in their digital journey. How to realize that dream? Because if we look where we want to go and where we're at, there is a gap. That gap consists of the correct skill sets, using a correct deployment framework, automating where it's beneficiary for you as a company. Compliancy frameworks have to be chosen that are cloud aware because it comes with different challenges. And you need a central cloud management platform. Cloud Fusion is that platform that can provide that unified governance for daily, but also for, from a management perspective. There are blades for monitoring, there are blades to check your costs, but there is also the way to have in one easy pane of glass, a complete overview of your solution. This brings the following benefits to the table. It gives you freedom of choice. 
where your workload lands will be determined by the workload, not only the, uh, the target zones you have. Workload can also base, uh, move based on their maturity level. Um, workload can start in the public cloud, go into production phase on your private cloud, and move back to the public cloud once the product has been terminated or the project has been terminated. And this is ju just the main benefit that unified management and that central governance. You could do everything yourselves, but it takes time to acquire a new skill set. It takes time to learn all these new cloud skills for your entire team and not just one person. Someone has to manage the cloud management platform. You don't want to build that on your own. You don't want to manage that on your own. Which is the correct framework to choose? How will you make that decision? There is no benefit of scale if you do this solo. So that makes for a high price tag on all these tools. Or you look for a partner, somebody that has a flexible approach, that has a broad skill level available, and that helps you grow at your own pace. And for that, we're Proximus. We help businesses enter the cloud age in a hybrid world. And we have devised a whole portfolio of services for you to help you wherever you are in the cloud journey. So whether you are just discovering and assessing the cloud, or you want to migrate your workloads to the correct location, or you're looking at a way to re-architect and rebuild your workloads, or need to optimize and learn from them, or having them secured and managed well, at each phase in the journey, Proximus will help you. And so for that, we have a whole team of cloud specialists ready to help you moving further in this wonderful cloud journey. So prepare yourself for the future that is now. Contact us for more information at these places. Thank you very much.